Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tinnager, and I am playing some Clock Tower 3. We need to go find the subordinate from this level and murder his face. Oh, balls. I got a teddy bear. Stay for me. Stay for me. You're creeping, I don't like you. Hi, Ghosty Goo. Please stay for me. I think the teddy bear needs to go over here. The scorched black and crushed box for this present being delivered. Was it a teddy bear? It was a teddy bear. And I think the other one is we need to find a piece of a necklace, but it's not outside. I think. Sigil stone! Because you saw that hand you know, poking out of that closet there. Wait, can I head over here? Uh-huh. Fill them. That one there. That hand. It needs a necklace. Can I open this? It is locked. Please stay away from me, Ghosty Goo. You have to find the other half of the necklace before we can release that poor Ghosty Goo. Dum, 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 dum. Might as well activate that now so I don't later. Cause those drag monsters. I went too far. He's blind. Your ghost to you. And he's bleeding from his eyes. Hi! Who are you? What are you doing here? Answer me! I don't wanna. What's that? What's that? What's going on? Mother. Where have you got to? Always oh, looking for his mommy. Say something. Mother. Oh. You need to help him find his mommy. His mommy's probably dead too. Oh. Again, I've played this game before, so. What's in here? It's locked. I'm not going up that way yet. Never mind, I guess I am. I didn't want to, but the game's making me do so. Cutscene! So many cutscenes at the beginning of each level. Why don't you just go find the other ghost and go, hey, is your mom's over here. Oh, it's the bell. Did he never wander into this room? Okay, then. It'd be crazy. So yeah, there's mommy. You can't help mommy. Okay. <coughs> oh gosh darn it, Nappa. <laughs> cuff, 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 cuff. Right, nope. I'm going up here. Stay with me, go to go. I don't want you, cause you're creepy. And as long as I don't trigger the stalker, I'm good. Moonflower. Turn it. So it faces the moon. Cause it's a moonflower, so it should be facing the moon, right? I don't wanna go down there yet. I wanna do stuff. Is there stuff? It's locked. 
course it's locked. It's always locked. Albert's Diary. November 13th. Piercy from the bakery gave me the name of a good optometrist in London. It's been seven years now since Mum lost her sight, and though she tries to appear cheerful, it's difficult to watch her grow old. Perhaps the doctor can do something to help her. It will be expensive. I wonder if my savings will be enough. Yesterday, a relative of ours, name of John Haig, came to s ask if he could stay with us. He was very cordial, but I can't help but think there's something calculating about him. I said so as much to Mother, who scolded me for judging a book by its color. I suppose she's right. Blood is thicker than water, as they say. I've been hearing strange noises at night for the last three days or so. I hear two burglars from striking homes in the area. I must remember to lock the doors and windows at night. The new guy's a murderer! Probably a subordinate. And probably my stalker. Step, 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 step. Oh, it's a shiny! Kitchen key! Let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go! Somebody's not very nice. Oh, it's another shiny, I need that. How far pendant? I know what that's for. I totally know what that's for. We need to go outside. Stay away from me, ghosty. Stay away from me, ghosty goo! I don't want your face. I'm leaving! Balls. Uh, apparently I'm not, but that half hour pendant is what I need to make the other ghost happy. Okay. Oh wait, was it this? I thought that was the kitchen. No, she was in the dining room. Never mind. Kitchen's this way. <coughs> Again, I apologize for all the coughing, guys. I can't. Dead body! Dead body, dead body, dead body. Dead body, dead body, dead body. Reporter's memo. Fan important clue to Rand's murder. We'll go back to house and investigate and gather info. Got a fe feeling about this. This will be the biggest scoop in Fleet Street. I'm on Fleet Street, really. Serial killer high meets Grizzly Uh John High, the serial killer on the run since early last year, has been found dead in a metal, pl metal plating works. High is held responsible for the cold-blooded murder of several pensioners whom he robbed before placing bodies in containers of sulfuric acid, thus disposing of the evidence. The acid used in the crimes was stolen, leading to the police to place factories in the area within stocks of sulfuric acid under surveillance. The suspect appeared at, the plant, at a planting factory in Horsham, and a struggle ensued. High lost his balance and fell from a platform into a vat of acid, ironically being the same end as his victims. Except he's not dead yet. Because, duh. Stay with me. You're a creeper. Okay, I want this, though. I need to burn by something. I need to give him film. I need to find him some film. First, I'm gonna do this. Nope! Rejected! Are you gonna give me film? I would be okay with some more film. Film is good. Nope, just invisibility band. <sighs> dum 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 da da da. So I guess I need to just go because I can't. I don't know where the freaking film is. Stay away from me. Why not? Then straighten it. <laughs> then straighten it! Jesus Christ. Okay. What do I have? Nothing. <laughs> now let me go. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Key items. Anything important? Oh, wait, I have a key. Oh, it's for the concert hall. Let me go, let me go, let me go. I wonder if a ghost can kill you. 
Maybe I should straighten it. Then straighten it! I hate you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't you be looking at me like that. Maybe I have to help him first? I don't know why I would need to help him first, but... <coughs> Film. 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 Locked. Film. Film. Film, 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 film. I'm supposed to just straighten that picture which opens the door so I can go through it. But the game's not letting me. I'm sorry for me. This ghost is just all kinds of up in my grill. Stay away from me. No, stay away from me! It's important. No, it's not. This is important. No, it's not. Please, open the frickin' door! Maybe I should straighten it, or maybe I should completely ignore this suggestion. I love you, but you're a jerk face. Is the door open? Maybe I I'm pretty sh mm, I'm gonna say that I need to find blah 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 the film for this guy. He just wants a hug. Just a little old hug. Dining table. Power's off. Uh, candle. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I'm assuming that it's important I go outside for something else. So. Is there anything else? Anything that I'm missing. I'll be right back, guys, when I find where I'm supposed to go from here. Huh? Why am I getting a cutscene? It's literally been like two seconds. Mommy! Mommy, 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 mommy. Mommy, mommy, mommy. Hi, Mom. Mom? Why are you ghosty goo? You are ghosty goo. Okay, so I guess I was going the right way. I just got myself confused. Doo -doo -doo. Why did mommy leave? Dick's desk key doesn't have a dildo. It makes sense with the name. Don't look at me like that, guys. <coughs> I make perfect sense. Dum 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 da da dum dum dum. Dum, dum, dum. Okay. We need to go to dearest grandpa's place. And also not even try to mention to totally not Ronald Weasley what just happened. I mean, it's not like he'd be curious or anything about where I disappeared to or the monsters or the acid or the or anything else. Do -do 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 -do. To Dick's room. Is it just me or does this house look a little bit darker now? It's probably just me, but... What do I know? Okay, I need to use a key. Not water, key. Oh, I just need to click on it. Never mind. Use Dick's desk. 
quick events, these two. In order to defeat a subordinate, the murdered soul which acts as its energy source must be healed. To, insti to instigate the healing process, a sentimental item belonging to that person must be obtained. If and when this item has been found, the ruder power is boosted temporarily. The ruder portal square appears, and within is found the sacred weapon necessary to vanquish the subordinate. My Boski! So the thing I already did. And there... A mask. Okay. Or somebody bought lots of film. Did you say film? I need some film! Wait a minute. Masks! Oh! Oh! Mask slot. I probably just need to click on it again instead of going to my inventory. This isn't Resident Evil! And of course, Daddy has a secret room, or Grandpa has a secret room as well. Box! There's the film I needed! Film. And probably a letter. It's like grandfather's writing. February 2nd, 1978. The Ruder who battled the entities are scattered all over Europe. We, the Hamiltons, are also of Ruder stock. Of this lineage, I am proud. The Ruder blood is passed down to females. My wife, Francesca, was a Ruder. In my naive youth, I did not... Like, oh, it's nothing! I denied the presence of entities and Ruders alike, preferring to believe that it was all just an old wives' tale. But then I found the Book of Entities, and Nancy began to sharpen her Ruder powers. I finally uh -huh. opened my eyes so to mom the was a reader. And began my research. Meaning I'm a reader. This is probably bad. Next day! Well, not next day, but later on. The Ruder powers first appear in a young woman's early teens and peak at age 15. The powers then gradually diminish, usually disappearing entirely by the age of 20. For generations. The women of the Hamilton clan have spent their teens fighting against subordinates for the ruder cause, before marrying in their twenties in order to produce the next generation of ruder. Well, what if they're a lesbian? Nancy is already 18. Her ruder powers are dwindling rapidly, and it is almost time for her to pass the job on to the next female. We Hamiltons think of our ruder blood as something of which to be proud as well as a responsibility that must be taken very seriously. I am sad to give my beloved Nancy to another man. But it to another be. man? Honey, please don't What's be obsessed with your daughter. That's kind of creepy. Another ruder has been born to the Hamilton household. My first grandchild. I chose for her the name... Why did Nancy. you name me? She is bright and lively. Perhaps even a little strong-willed and yet appears somehow wise beyond her years. I pray she will grow strong and healthy and will fulfill her obligation as a noble ruler. But then Mommy probably stepped in and said, Nope! That's what I'm assuming happened. A ruder family. So, I am a ruder. It's in my blood. Yep, you're supposed to destroy evil things. Yay! Leave it to Why me. Why do the powers peak at age 15? I have the same mood of strain in my blood as my mother. I can save Dorothy and Albert. Then and only then will I be able to leave this nightmare and see my mother. Nice, no, I got a couple more to I'm kill. Sure that's the way. Isn't nope. It? That's not how your life's going to play out, honey buns. I apologize. But yeah, I'm a rooter. Well, Alyssa's a rooter, and we are now leaving Dick's room, and we need to go save Alyssa, or Albert, and Dorothy in the next video. My name is Miss Guy Tanager, and I am playing some Quantum. I'll see you all in the next video.